Alchemy live and direct coming from a massive pep game, top two clash, myself at home to Stoic and unfortunately for myself we come off the back of a 1-0 defeat. Um, I feel like we played very very well, tactically we were the best I've ever been. Um, I had a formation up on the screen that I was never going to play. I waited till the last few seconds then changed to a formation which I've heard him say in an interview that he might struggle with. <clears throat> or oh, not the formation but three at the back he said he was unsure of. And at the beginning of the game I felt him trying to work out how to deal with it and it gave me the early impetus. So many corner kicks came my way as we mounted pressure upon their goal. But as you'd expect from um, somebody that has won as many titles in the peppers they have, he weathered the storm and weathered the storm and hung in there. And then he started to grow into the game, I feel. But I also feel that I was I had quite a degree of control in that game. And had I not been on 18 points and him on 24 points, I would have having the respect I do for Stoic just taken the draw and just yeah basically I'd have just taken the draw but because of the situation as you can see there's my formation now changed he didn't have time to change his but yeah because of the situation me on 18 points him on 24 I had to keep going forward and um, that meant that he got an opportunity in the last minute which he took he kept his composure uh, Mark of the true champion, he's come away with all three points from a game that I deserved at the very least a draw, what I feel. But I'm very happy with the lads. Uh, like I said, tactically, I think I've, I've, I've outdone myself really. Um, and we're definitely improving. It's just unfortunate that I'm playing against such a good player and having to win the game which just meant that I had to keep going forward, like I've already said. So, you know, big up Stoic. They've won every single game now. And um, I've lost my first game and conceded my first goal against the human. But you know, these bitch ass clubs have put me in that situation, I feel. You know, because that, that, that could have just been a draw and I'd have, I'd have taken it, I'd have been happy with that. But because of the circumstance, I couldn't, I couldn't settle for a draw. And um, what can I say? Uh, that's about it really. I've got to look at the tape again and see if there is anything I could have done better. Maybe Zuma was at fault for the goal. If so, he's got to go. The standards are high at this club. But I feel like Richarlison uh, being a super sub, the game was just scripted for him to score that goal and there wasn't anything I could do. But I'm going to have a look at it. Um, and see if I can change anything or improve anything. Funny enough, I met up with Stoic during a festive season in which he said it will not be any of my superstars or big guns that are going to breach your defence. It's going to be someone like Richarlison. And funny enough, it was Richarlison. Congratulations, Stoic. Um, this puts you big time in the driving seat now and I, I can't see any of these other guys having the strength of character to beat you or bring it to you like like I did. Some people lost some bread. Someone just died. Police they come, I mean they come. Confusion everywhere.